Hey guys, it's Chelsea Messenger with Picks and Parlays. We're talking college hoops uh, headed to uh, West Virginia, where Texas is on the road at West Virginia. It's Wild Card Weekend in the NFL, and we've got a special promo code. The code is WILD for 20% off the entire site at picksandparlays.net. West Virginia is home underdogs. Texas favored minus one. The total is 140 and a half. The Longhorns enter nine and one on the year. Five and five against the number, while West Virginia is nine and three and six and six against the spread. We've got Chip Travis joining us here uh, to talk college basketball. Chip, what stands out to you about these two teams? It's it's going to be a great matchup, and I think it's actually going to be a defensive matchup with what I see here. Texas was great for us a couple of times out. They beat Kansas by twenty five, and I was looking to see if they would stumble next time out against Iowa State. They maintained their poise, and they got the victory over the Cyclones. So this Texas team is someone we may, we may have to deal with big level at the end of the season. They're number four in the nation right now, and they have the big men. Only one true road game. They're 1-0. and But, you know, West Virginia coached by Huggins always seems to come up with great defensive pressure, a great defensive game plan. And I think this is part of their philosophy here that even if they can't get by this Texas team, but they're ranked 14th in the nation as it is, the Mountaineers. But they're going to do it defensively. Uh, Texas has gone under 14 and 5 against teams with winning records. And at home, uh, West Virginia has gone 10 and 4 to the under in their last 14. I think this game goes under meetings, uh, six meetings between these two, five have gone under. I'm going to play under between Texas and West Virginia Saturday, 1 p.m. Eastern start. Uh, any other tidbits you think better should know before uh, placing a bet when it comes to college basketball? Well, you know, I think doing your homework and, and understanding team trends just seem to um, they pan out. You know, there, there's a team that I just remember in football at times when teams would beat a team consecutively, no matter what, because they'd be scheduled the same weekend after a homecoming or after a big game. And that letdown was always there. So um, sometimes in basketball, you can watch for the same thing um, when they're doubling up. All right, always sage advice from Chip Cherimbus when it comes to handicapping sports. As always, great stuff, Chip. Uh, thanks for joining us.